Well, Natalie, I sat down with two drivers and NASCAR fans as they were watching the Sprint Cup race today, which Stewart was set to compete in until he pulled out this morning. Here's what they had to say about what the accident means for the sport. Matt Helbing and Chris Camp have been around the racetrack for many years. It started when I was 14 years old. I went to Rome Speedway and loved it ever since. Today, they were watching the NASCAR Sprint Cup race at the Watkins Glen International Racetrack, a race the three-time NASCAR champion Tony Stewart was going to be driving in. He chose not to drive after hitting and killing another driver last night in upstate New York. The one thing that they've always told us is stay in the car, and that's the main thing you want to do because it's the safest place for you unless you're on fire. But the young driver didn't. 20-year-old Kevin Ward Jr. got out of his car and walked onto the track after being clipped. We also spoke with Steve Hickson from Boyd Speedway in Ringgold, someone who is very familiar with the racetrack. Unfortunately, the, the race wasn't red flagged. Uh, when you red flag a race, all cars have to stop immediately. The race was given a yellow flag, so the driver slowed from close to 100 miles per hour to 30 to 35. We have rules in place. NASCAR has rules in place. The sprint car organization that we're racing last night has rules in place to keep the drivers safe. That doesn't mean they're going to follow those rules. Even with the looming suspension or fines. Hickson says he's seen drivers get out of the car many times because of tempers, despite rule number 43, not to get out of a car unless the driver is in immediate danger. The people can't play the blame game on this. It's something that's happened and it's it, it's going to be a little bit like what happened with Dale Earnhardt. Something good will come out of this about this young man being killed. They're all hoping it's something that has to do with safety. Now, Ward was in his fifth season racing in the Empire Super Sprint Series. Natalie? All right, Betsy, thank you. And we will continue to follow any new developments on this story and bring them to you as they become available.